Good morning, everybody. Michael the Maven. Today, I am going to give you my review of Lindsay Adler's Magic of Gels. It's a tutorial she just came out with recently. If you're not aware of who Lindsay Adler is, she's a Canon explorer of light, extremely talented. If you do any kind of portrait photography, you need to add her to your Instagram right away. Check it out. I'll put that link in the description as well. Look at her work that she's doing. She's very, very good. I, I would say she's at, at the top of her game right now if you're looking for a fashion or portrait photographer. Really amazing. So, you know, you're looking at these images and you're wondering how in the world did she do these types of shots? Lo and behold, she comes out with the magic of gels, which is her tutorial on using colored gels with strobe photography. Before we get into the review, I have to emphasize I have no affiliation with Lindsay Adler. I know I've made a couple comments to her on social media, and that has been the extent of our relationship. I've never met with her. I've never spoken with her. This is not a paid advertisement. She didn't ask me to do it. This is just something that I want to put out there because I'm a huge believer in tutorials. I am the sum of all of the best things that I've learned from other photographers. There, there's been so many mentors and instructors that I've had over the years, and it's not really my desire to copy somebody. What I try to do is I try to look at what they're doing really, really well and take the things that I like and include it in my own arsenal. So, you know, the more you study great photographers, the bigger and the higher elevated your game is going to be. So always look for work that you admire and ask yourself the question, how can I do this kind of a shot? How did they pull it off? What would I need to do? And that's the beauty of when a photographer comes out with a tutorial, they're, they're hand giving it to you on a silver platter. And in most cases, not always, but in most cases, anywhere from you know, 100 to 200, sometimes $300, usually a pretty good value, and you'll know it as soon as you watch it. So the cost of Magic with Gels is $99. You view it streaming on her website. She also has a gel pack that you can purchase. For the super high-end shooters, there's not a lot of them that do everything. Typically, they're really you know, looking at one type of photography and they're getting really good at it. The reason I make that point is because you can go out and learn how to do all these things on your own. I, I could have gone out and figured out how to do this, but my time is important to me, and watching the tutorial, she breaks it down so quick and easy that you know, for a three hour tutorial, I know pretty much everything that I need to make these kinds of shots happen. I even have a strobe course. I've just never really messed around with gels. I have gels, I've never used them. I wanna share some of my images with you. I have a friend who lives here. I said, hey, I'm trying out a new technique. And this is really important is that when you're learning new things in photography, give yourself permission to fail. Just say, hey, I'm gonna go screw this up and it's okay. And have fun messing up and then take a look at your work. The takeaway message I wanna give with you guys is absolutely the course was worth it for me. I, I learned a ton. Lindsay, I think you have an outstanding course. I think you did a really, really good job on it. She's completely transparent. And I would say if you practice these techniques and you have all the gear on hand, you're gonna learn pretty much in about three or four shoots. You'll have a pretty good idea. One wonderful thing that she did was she included a PDF that showed all the lighting setups and which gels and which modifier really outstanding overview of how to get certain looks. With every review that I do now, I'm trying to give positives as well as negatives. The negatives are less to do with the teaching style, it has more to do with the amount of equipment that you're going to need to get in order to pull these kinds of shots off. I don't think you could get the types of shots that she's consistently doing without having three strobes, four probably, and in some cases five, you're gonna need multiple gel packs. The grids and the honeycombs, I didn't have enough to do it on my first shoot, so I, I had to order some. And I'm gonna do this again, having more strobes. I only had two strobes, but I wanted to see you know, how much I could do with just two strobes, and I think I have a pretty good idea now. What I would say is this, number one, is an advanced technique. Uh, you gotta have all the basics down. Probably should take a lighting course before you take the magic of gel so you know how the strobes work and the basics of lighting. And you're gonna need a lot of equipment in order to pull off this type of high-end shooting. A Couple other things I wanna mention about Lindsay's work that she's really, really good at is the art design in the makeup, the models, in the posing. So even, you know, understanding the color techniques, there's four or five other variables you would have to really have dialed in to consistently get those results. But if you had them, you could definitely learn enough from her tutorial to pull it off. So in any event, Lindsay, it's a great tutorial. I really enjoyed it. Thank you so much for putting it together. In any event, I hope you guys enjoyed my review of Lindsay Adler's Magic with Gels. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.